two free apps at the end of this video. Oh, kissing. Bunnies are kissing. Nina's wearing her gray jeans that haven't fit until now, even though she's worn them in the past. And she's wearing some big boots that I think fit her. But they're pretty big. We're going to deliver it today. Mommy's excited. Hey, George. We got something for you. That's not me. That's not me. I'm more handsome. Oh my god. Thank you. Who tried this one? Linda? Linda. Thank you, Linda. Don't worry, just Selena's next. Thanks. Nina's trying to be creative with her sitting. We thought he would like it more than he did. Everyone else liked it though. Unfortunately, uh, Juscelino, the owner, is not here today and 
we're sure that he would have gotten a big kick out of it, but uh, he's not here, so maybe we'll see him tomorrow. Kyle is about to finish this uh, applesauce all by himself. No help from Nina. Matter of fact, mommy can't feed him fast enough. He gets known. upset in between spoonfuls. <laughs> Nina is of course enjoying her cheese, bacon, and croissant. Cal finished eating, and he almost finished his uh, apple sauce. Just a little bit left in here, very little, but it's the most he's eaten so far. Now he's gonna start on the sandwich. Okay. I don't want no wrinkles. No wrinkles. And no white shit, thank you. No white. All right, we got it. Okay. okay. George wanted, requested to get rid of the wrinkles and the white on the beard, so we're going to do that and then give it back. Or, okay, I'm going to repaint just this part of the face and then we'll give it back and let's see if he likes it. Everybody likes our little George thing though, except for George, but everybody else that passes by and sees it, they're like, oh, good job. Nina might not get to horse today. It looks like it's out of order. Yeah, I'm sorry. Aww. It's okay, baby. We'll come back tomorrow. Nina basically had the same sandwich that I ate for breakfast today. She had cheese and bacon, croissant, and a tiny, tiny little bit of egg, but it was actually just touching the uh, the bread, the croissant, so almost my sandwich. Catch the squirrel, get the squirrel, get the squirrel. Get it. Well, that squirrel's missing hair. Squirrel! Oh man, I called the squirrels instead of scaring the squirrels. Our tenant Ashley asked me to move her car over today to a Thursday spot so that it can stay there for the rest of the week until next Thursday. And did that and got the spot in front of the house, which is cool because now we can make sure that three cars fit there instead of just two. Mommy's repainting. Honestly, I normally like it when the shadows in the face are done by the model and not painted in. But what mommy did with this was actually really good and it looked good. It's just George didn't want to look that old. So we're going to paint the wrinkles a normal skin color and just let the sh shadows of the model do the work. Um, and I, hopefully that will make him happy because I'm not going to reprint it or do any 3D work to it. Not sure what Cal is doing. Had a little bit of camera trouble earlier today, so I don't know what footage I have right now. But Nina slept for about 
two hours and 45 minutes. She fell asleep on my mommy's back. She, mommy put her on the ergo and on the back while she started cleaning up and Nina fell asleep almost immediately. Say hi, Nina. She hasn't really been able to play much of an uh, iPad today, so we're letting her play for a little bit, but not for too long. We got her a new app. She hasn't discovered it yet, though. Earlier today in the morning, uh, Ashley asked us to move her car for her, and I did, and also ensured that we have three parking spots in front of the house instead of just two. Here's mommy, and she's training Cal how to use the potty, kind of like Nina was trained when she was younger that she forgot about. We're hoping that Cal doesn't get sick halfway through and can continue doing this until he gets older. Say hi, Nina. Mommy's still upstairs, so Cal will be down in a second. But they're gonna go on a little walk and find some squirrels and give them peanuts. Right, Nina? Peanuts for the squirrels? What do the squirrels eat? What do they eat? The squirrels. No, they don't eat bunnies, they eat peanuts. So, funny story. Oh, mommy's here, she could hear the story. So, one of, uh, I guess, the people in the neighborhood passed by and saw her, saw Nina, and said, Hi, hi, pretty girl. And then he looked at me and he said, Looks just like you. I look like a pretty girl. All right, here they are. There's Nina. And there's Cal. And this can lay down more if Cal feels uncomfortable. Oh, let's stand them. Let's sit him up a little bit more. Or we can sit him up a little more. That's good. There we go. And this thing covers all the way in case, I don't know, he needs to be covered all the way. Oh boy. Why'd you take off your boots? Okay, mommy help. Shoes. Okay. So Nina doesn't seem to be comfortable in the first seat. We might have to put her back. And I don't know if it's leaned back too much, but I don't think Cal is comfortable in the back, so we're gonna have to switch them around. On our way home now. There's Pops. We fixed George, and we're gonna show him that tomorrow. I think the squirrels are asleep, Nina. I think the squirrels went to sleep. Twinkle, twinkle, little squirrel. You're asleep. Oh well. You hear them? Cal has nothing to say about this. Cal momentarily fell asleep. Oh, oh, you want what? What do you want? The blowfish? Say blowfish. Blow fish. Blowfish. Nina's outgrowing some of her towels. So it's harder to keep her inside of this and warm. She's old enough now where she realizes that if she covers herself, she'll keep herself warm, so she does help. Nina's quite sleepy since she only had a two hour nap today, as opposed to the three hour and a half naps that she's been having the past couple of days. And I'm gonna read her some books, four of them today, and hope that she goes down easier than she did last night. I just realized I forgot to mention this is new pajamas. These are new pajamas that Nina's wearing. They were sent to her from her grandma in Florida. Oh no no And they're very pretty pajamas. 
Also, today Cal turned five months old. He's old news now. We're gonna have to get a job. Start providing for the family. Got a chance to work on the characters today. And I started dressing this guy up and finished one arm. One leg, well both legs are pretty much done. Just have to add that shoe on that side, so that's just going to be a duplicate. Gave him a suit and a tie that he's going to be wearing. This is how it fits with the rest of the character. It's going to hide the hands. So I have this arm here placed, but it doesn't have any. Uh, it doesn't have a suit yet. Doesn't have any clothing. That side does though. That's the girl. And this is the hair right now, but I think that I'm going to be changing it. I didn't finish the back, I just wanted to do something in the front to see what it looks like. But uh, I think I'm going to be changing it so that it's curlier and also looks more like it's folding into his arms. Because right now it looks kind of like it just stops there. Except for there, that one is good. And that's what it looks like with shadows. Again, this, this arm is not done yet, but it will be soon. Good night, Nina. Good night, Kyle. We love you. Bye. Today is March 27 of 2015, and these are your free apps. First, we have Battle Camp, which is $8.99, and today it's free. And it's basically kind of like a Pokemon game where you evolve your characters and then have them fight against other people who have evolved their characters. Fun stuff. And for those of you who are not into games, there's also a photo app today called Photo Just Book in FX, uh, FX for Instagram. And that one, also normally $10, today is free. It allows you to put in all types of sparkly effects in your photos for sharing on Instagram or I guess any other way you want to share. And those are the free apps for today. Download them before the sale ends.